Greetings friends, I'm the Klutza Gamer and this is Don't Starve Shipwrecked. So I've kind of played Don't Starve before, but I figured let's try it out. So I'm going to just do a completely new one. New game. I do not know what these mean, so I'm just going to hit start. Do I want to make it compatible? I'm kind of nervous. This will add new mechanics to your world, like wetness and overheating. Um, I'm going to say no, because I'm kind of scared. I've always heard this game is a bit hard. Generating world. Just a little fun to, to have before you, the new year. Why not? You don't look so good. Good plan. So I'm assuming, with it being Don't Star, I need to find food. Is a bee? Flower? I'm gonna pick some flowers. Ooh, look, a bush! Now I know you gotta make a lot of things with this game, so let's pick... Try to pick as many things as I can. Carrot. This is good, we already have some food. So over here on the left is tools, light, and survival. So you need light at night, of course, and sometimes to cook. Like a torch, fire pit, campfire. You need tools like axes or hatchets to cut... No, it is axe. To cut trees down, pickaxe to cut rocks. Let's see. I just need a uh, flint. So I'll keep an eye out for that. And over here on the right, it shows the time of day, what day it is. Um, I believe this is your stomach, so constantly going down because you need food. This is health. I'm assuming there's fighting mechanics. And I guess this is sanity. Maybe it's kind of like very Lovecrafting on that you have to maintain some sanity. I don't know. Already coming up with quite the inventory. Another carrot. Looks like those things do not want me. Flint! Let's see. Let's make an axe. Alright, so I now need to prepare for the night, so let's see. I need some to chop. Wood. Stop it. Takes a lot of clicking. And I can already see that down in this lower left, lower right hand corner. My axe is already at 85%. So I may want to go ahead and begin looking for another piece of flint. Because now it's already at 75%. I really like the artwork, though. It's not as intense as, like, The Witcher 3, but it's very... It has its own style. I like games that seem to have their own feel to them. Like, they're not just trying to emulate other games. And this really feels like a game that is not trying to emulate anything else. The only thing I would say it's maybe imitating is it really reminds me of like a Tim Burton movie. But I mean that in the utmost respect, like old Tim Burton, not like Alice in Wonderland Part 15. Flint! I don't like that sound. A wormhole. Maybe not on day one. We got enough for another axe, because we're at 65%. Campfire. A trap! Maybe I can use this for that little bird.
Maybe I should pick my trap back up. Ah, I can see my sanity starting to go down. My hunger's up. I'm gonna build a fire. Now, I would not recommend this in real life. I'm gonna build a fire right next to these trees. What's gonna happen is I'm gonna have a lot of availability of trees, of firewood. This doesn't seem like the most exciting game out on the front end. I need to add fuel. There we go. See that there? It's kind of like the beginning of like an Age of Empires type of game where you know you just it's a lot of gathering the basic resources trying to build yourself up. So while we got fire here, let's look at this. Science and fight. Ooh, so there's fighting. Spear. Grass suit. Cut grass. Twigs. Got plenty of twig. Beer. Log suit. I need to build a science machine. Science. I need gold and rock. I haven't seen any of those lately. Let's add more fuel. See, my hunger's down to 99, so let's see. Okay, so that's about 20. Maybe a little less than 20. I'm just gonna... I'm being safe. Although I'm not really doing a bang up job with keeping... I organize this. Let me get... There we go. can see now is that every time I walk away from my little fire, my sanity does not appreciate that. Let's see, is this the same type of cut grass I need for a suit? Yes, it is. This is really dark now. So I'd, I'm kind of scared because I've heard that if you are in the pitch black night, not good things happen. I'm already at 25% of my axe, so it's a good thing I got another flint. Very creepy. I think I can also... Can't I build... If I need more grass. This was a mistake. Whoa. Definite mistake, so noted. For the next night, I'm gonna build either a fire pit or have enough for a torch. It's very creepy. I'm not gonna lie. If you've seen any of my other videos, you know that I'm a very nervous person. Don't know why I play games like Darkest Dungeon and try to take on everything that's crazy in The Witcher 3, but I guess I like to give my heart a work. map. I guess that's the wormhole. Interesting. I guess it kind of helps you to keep track of all the resources that can be available. Dress. Looks like I made it through day one. I think I'm going to call it a day here, and I hope you all have a good one. Take care. Look, it's already saving for me. There we go. Bye-bye, y'all.